What's up YouTube? I'm here with a mail update. Got some stuff in here the last couple weeks. I'm going to start with uh, Ricky Russo was uh, giving away some one-on-ones. I know most of y'all out there probably probably have uh, seen this guy's videos. He he busts a lot of incredible stuff. Pulls amazing. And he sent me this one-on-one. -on -one. I want to say thank you, Ricky. There's the man's autograph. Ricky Russo. And let's see here. There we go. It is from the Brooklyn Nets. And I think that's Toronto Raptors. Uh, Jonas Palacianos and Tornike Shingalia. So that's pretty neat. Printing plate there for the basketball YouTube PC there. And uh, next up is a graded card. 9.510 of Jeremy Sowers, who is from Willing, West Virginia. Got that real cheap. It was like less than five bucks shipped. I don't think he's no longer baseball, I don't believe, or he's in the minors there. Next up, I got this Stedman Bailey lot. Uh, some pretty nice cards here. Stedman Bailey Prestige. Stedman Bailey Prime. Base Tops. Rookie. Base Tops Chrome. Rookie. Bowman. White paper, base I guess. Black. I might go for rainbow on these. Uh, the blue. My gold. I uh, got it. Tops chrome. There. Uh, Stedman Bailey HRX. Stedman Bailey Prism. And. This, this Eric Dickerson was just in there, so prison. And that lot included this autograph too. I think I got that whole lot for I think it was around five bucks shipped, so not bad. Next up, uh, I got a racing lot, Dale Earnhardt cards, off eBay. I haven't heard anything more about press pass. NASCAR. I know Wheels used to make a uh, racing product. But I don't know if they're still in it. I don't think. Let's move on to these NASCAR cards. Uh, the short print insert out of the upper deck. Dale Earnhardt. Wheels High Gear 98. Pure Gold. Uh, pole position, I think this was number three. Uh, driver's choice, a VIP. Uh, this the Alan Hart rookie of the year, 1979. Which he never had a his rookie card wasn't until '89, I believe it was '89, '90. And it just didn't make racing cards back then, I guess. Here's a Earnhardt Parallel. Uh, Chase the Champion. And uh, Clear Cut. The Acetate cards. Uh, that's pretty neat. Got those. Uh, next up, I got a Geno Smith. Parallel card from Elite. That's just jersey number. I don't know if it'll pick up, but it's seven to twenty-five. I think I got it for like three bucks. Next up, I got this nice Geno Smith one card from Museum Collection, eighteen to fifty-five. And my first one-on-one. 
in uh, let's do this one first it's nice Stedman or Tavon Austin shadow box art it's really neat 3d effect and uh, next card is going to be my first one-on-one in my West Virginia PC I got this card for 10 bucks shipped it's Tavon Austin printing plate from his rookie year tops and uh, I've been working on set of trying to get a autograph from every member of the original dream team I've acquired Michael Jordan which was the probably the hardest one to get so you guys know what his autographs go for I uh, got Larry Bird uh, David Robinson and this one will be the fourth I got Christian Leitner I always love the looks of these cards here there's uh, ring cards uh, next up I got I got a card off bought a card off of a one of the web Facebook website one of the college groups I got I had uh, this card up Steve Slayton the contenders in a West Virginia uniform it's really wicked you don't see that one up too often and uh, he sent this base as an extra so that's really neat I've been looking for that that autograph there for a while Mountaineers uniform short print variation I believe and then I got uh, Steve Slayton Owen Schmidt duel that's pretty neat and another Steve Slayton I picked up it's pretty rare autograph out of upper deck premiere it is three out of five I really got a heck of a bargain on this I think it was around six bucks shipped for this card beautiful card and in the next pickup I got I uh, made a trade for this card uh, I'm about 90% sure this is an authentic Gellner Harf card that I got from a friend trade and a massive trade I traded a lot of stuff away for this card and I'm hoping maybe Dominus Infinitus was uh, doing, doing the TTM thing. We you send your cards in and they authenticate them through Beckett. I want to say Beckett. Maybe PSA. And I know RBI crew has James Spence in their shop every once in a while. But I really want to send that in and get that encased. So hopefully it comes back authentic I think that it will uh, thanks for watching guys and keep an eye out for my next vid see you later